<laughs> yes, it's, it's a very simple technique. It was the latest technique developed in New Zealand um, by two um, family physicians and then I was the third to join them. It is um, radio frequency surgery. You just give a local anesthetic inside the soft palate, um, touch with a, an anesthetic gel, then inject it like the dentists do and the palate gets anesthetized. You put a probe inside, press the button of the radio frequency for 10 seconds to 20 seconds. Minimum is takes is 10 seconds, maximum 20 seconds, and the meat inside the pellet, the muscle inside the pellet gets cooked. It's radio frequency, so it's better than microwave, but it cooks like microwave, you know. The portion swells for two days, and then within seven days, it comes back to normal, and within six weeks, it forms a scar inside, within the pellet. A scar means, Pellet was loose before it gets tightened and, you know, thinner as well as tighter. Hence the flopping of the uh, pellet stops or gets low. The success rate is around 70%. But then in addition, you have to see if the tongue is very thick. Some people have got very thick tongue. The same thing can be done to the posterior part of the tongue with the same machine, uh, or same probe and can also be done to the turbinates. If the turbinates and the, especially the lower turbinate is very swollen, you can put that probe in, press the button for five seconds, that also goes down. You can do the same with uvula, which hangs at the back. If a uvula is too big and thick, you can either cut it off there and then under local anesthesia, or you can put the probe inside and the uvula also shrinks and becomes small. So it's a very good surgery technique for snoring. And of course, if somebody is obese and all that stuff, those things have to be taught to them how to get rid of the weight and all that stuff, which is two and a half hours session. And uh, the brilliant results. Yeah.